this all to ourselves. How is this real? <laughs> stay at Lake Argyle. We spent three nights there, just ducked up to Kununurra last night, just stayed there for the one night just to grab a few supplies because, mate, we are at the start of the Gibb River Road. Our first turn off was 36 k's from the eastern end of the Gibb River Road into El Questro Station. El Questro has a bit of everything to offer with some steep and rocky four-wheel drive tracks, awesome sunset lookouts and some of the most amazing gorge walks with the most picturesque waterfalls and swimming holes at the end of. on their way today going the whole way through El Cuestro Gorge. So we actually did come here the other day, it was a bit late in the Arvo, uh, we made it to the halfway pool 
that was still a good couple of hour walk on its own. So today is our last day at El Cuestro. Uh, so we've decided, bugger it, we might as well do the whole hike, get all the way to the end and see supposedly the most spectacular waterfall on the station. Um, there is quite a few deep bits you gotta get through and go right through a, a water hole and climb up some big rocks and stuff. So we'll take you on the adventure and show you when we get there. I can't wait. Excitement levels have arisen. I can hear it. I can hear it. We can hear the waterfall. There's a waterfall. Well, <laughs> got excited and thought it was a waterfall. It's just rushing water through these giant rocks. Yeah, that's really funny. <sighs> places we've ever been to. Absolutely really cool. I could spend all day there I reckon. If you haven't been here yet, get here now. So it's a fair old trek in but yeah we had a wicked swim. We're just gonna chill here for a little while, have some lunch. Peaceful little backdrop. We really didn't film too much from this point on. It had already taken us three and a half hours just to get to the end of El Cuestro Gorge and we knew that we'd be running out of daylight very rapidly. From here, we made our way to camp on the banks of the Pentecost River just for a quick overnight stay before making our way down the rest of the Gibb River Road. 